Hello there. Thank you for joining me in Moving Wheels. And today, guess where I'm taking you? I'm taking you to Nairobi City. And we are going to uh, see Jogo Road. Jogo Road is one of the common roads in Kenya, which is loved by so many and mostly public uh, vehicles or uh, public service vehicles. These are buses. It is very much common because it is like the gateway to Nairobi City. This is where you find most of the buses from many of the major uh, towns within uh, within Nairobi or out of Nairobi. This road feeds most of the vehicles from out and feeds uh, or brings many, many people to the town center as you can be able to see. So this is Jogo Road. And we have on the left Makadara railway station and uh, it's still active but not very much so you can still be able to access the city but it is not exactly in the CBD or in the town it is just in the outskirts of Nairobi but are st are st are still reachable one thing you're going to observe in this road is that there are also residential areas where people have rented but mostly I want you to notice that there is a lot of matatus as we call them here in kenya uh public service vehicles we yes we do have some private vehicles as you can see but many of them are uh, buses that are ferrying people to the town center and very much common outside uh, out of the roads you'll see businesses that are all over people selling all kinds of things like on the left side you can see there is a lot of nice wonderful um sofa sets and many other things that you're able to see this road is normally uh, notorious with traffic jam especially in the morning hours because that is when everyone is moving so if you happen to be here in morning hours that is between 6 and 8 and possibly 9 a.m it is usually very uh, with a lot of traffic you'll see there are so many vehicles and uh, movement is very low I'm actually passing through this road around, it's around 11, 11.30 a.m. And so we do not have a lot of traffic, as you can be able to see. We are moving at a very fast rate, apart from, we, we are slowing a little bit when there, is, there are many vehicles or some vehicles are exiting. But during the morning hours, this road is normally, um, it's normally so much, or it has a lot of, a lot of vehicles a lot of vehicles and you can you can actually be stuck in traffic jam for many many hours there is a bus there that is being pushed it must have stopped moving and they are finding a way of making sure that it is moving thank you again for subscribing to my channel i'm here to show you places you know places you don't know content that you've never seen and even content that you have seen. Look at that church. We have a church here, a very huge church, uh, which is just opposite uh, the left side of Jogo Road, as you can be able to see. Thank you for subscribing, and I want to ask you to continue sharing with more people. Let us grow this channel. It is my prayer that very soon we will. It is going to grow in term in terms of subscribers, and even viewership because that is my main purpose to reach as many people as possible so hit the subscription button and uh, hit the bell so that you can get all my videos i want you to look at a bus there's a bus there which is in front of me it's well decorated some of in kenya most of the buses are so much <laughs> pimped up that that basically means they are really so much decorated i want you to look at this bus um they do a lot of drawing and most of them look very nice with very funny funny drawings as you can see this one it looks <laughs> very interesting with some cartoons well pump, uh, pimped and so this is very common in kenya a bus is not just left with one color like it is just white it is yellow no they make sure that it is uh they, they draw so many drawing um it will depend with the past the owner of the bus what they would want so if you come to kenya you'll see my tattoos or buses they are really well decorated 
this is one of the oldest flyovers as you can be able to see people are able to cross over it's only for people to cross over to avoid them being knocked by the vehicle so we're just heading to uh, to the town center and there's a roundabout around there and as you can see there are so many posters of campaigning we in the campaigning period and so we're having uh, people who want to be elected as leaders many posters as you can be able to see so this is another roundabout going all the way there's an exit on the left side which goes to Mutindwa not Mutindwa actually it goes to uh, to Machakos country bus as you can be able to see um, so that is where we are heading on the right side you will see um, Juakali that is where we have at San who make things locally using the local materials I have done a video on your Kali. Go and check it out. You'll be able to see much of that content. So on the left, on the right side, there is what we call the famous Machakos Country Bus. I hope one day I can do a video there for you to be able to see it. But look at the road now. It is very going to the town. You can see Nairobi City Town. Uh, it's clear, very clear. Uh, not much traffic jam as you can be able to see. So it's very clear. On the left side, you can see buildings, old buildings. They used to be owned by the government those those yesterdays, but now some people have, are, are in charge of them. Now we are getting to town center and no traffic at all. The road is very smooth and uh, people are crossing, crisscrossing. Sometimes people don't like using the flyovers. They just want to cross. You can see there are no people that on those flyovers. But they are meant for people to go through so we are just in the town and i will see you in the next video as i get to show you more of nairobi town remember this was jogoro that we, we saw and continue watching bye bye for now thank you